Hey friends, I am talking to our cut file users today. So you know where our cut files are on our website. We have a lot of fun new designs. What's happened is Cricut has published an update for their design space software that you use to cut your uh, cut files out of your HDV or paper or however you're using them. And this update has caused a lot of files to actually uh, import incorrectly. So here's a video that helps you troubleshoot how to fix that if you're running into this problem. So you're going to go ahead and upload your image just like you normally would. The file I'm using is Your Life Has Purpose. And you can tell that the eyes are uploading in weird spots. They're not where they're supposed to be. So we're going to go ahead and right click and then go to ungroup. And there's also an ungroup over in the menu bar if you prefer that. Now each of these lines is grouped. So what we're going to do is ungroup each of those individually. Same thing, just right click and ungroup. And then you can move the eye back to where it's supposed to be. And we're going to do those for each of these little eyes that has decided to go wonky and go off on its own. Um, we're not 100% sure what is causing this. Uh, I've seen it all over Cricut that people are running into this issue. So unfortunately, this is our troubleshooting for right now until we can go in and see if this is a permanent fix with the design space um, or a permanent update with design space or if they're going to go through and fix this, whatever's causing these to glitch. But for right now, um, this is our solution. So you just ungroup every single one that has a piece that is in the wrong spot. You can move it up and then like this one, the I was hiding behind another letter. So I just scooted it out and then I'm going to go ahead and with each of these, group them back together. And the way that I like to do this is we're actually going to weld all of the pink and then weld all of the black. And the reason I actually do that is because then it cuts out with those spaces between the lines and I don't have to go through and line everything up. So what I'm gonna do, oh, there's one more eye that I need to put back into place. There we go. And I'm gonna select each line individually and I'm going to weld those letters together so weld is down there at the bottom and then I'm going to go through and select all of our black parts and weld that all as one. Now you have to do this uh, individually just because you can't overlap the pink part or it will um, weld those together as well and we want that to cut in a different color. So I like to do this by welding each line and then you go through and select all the black ones, weld them together. And then you'll see when you scoot it out, it maintains those spaces, which makes it really easy for lining up your cut file after. And then you can select all of your pink ones, weld those together, and you are ready to cut. We get a lot of questions on why our individual letters are not welded together and or lines. And this is why, so you can change the colors of things as you want and then weld together what you want. So that is our fix for this design space update that is causing things to import incorrectly. Hopefully that helps you out. Um, feel free to let us know if you have any other questions.